Definitely less humid air across the area, which makes it more comfortable to be out there. There's North Carolina A&T State University on the screen with sunshine across the area. And yeah, temperatures that are in the 80s. We've got 84 in Greensboro, 85 in Winston-Salem, 86 right now in Burlington. It's the Battle of I-40 tonight. First pitch is at 630 and it will be warm with temps in the low 80s, but very comfortable and clear skies are expected for tonight. In the mountains and foothills, we've got temperatures in the 70s at Meadows of Dan, Pilot Mountain at 79, Mount Airy at 82, and in North Wilkesboro right now at 85 degrees. Big night for racing. You saw John Johnson there in the stands with all of the fans. We've got temperatures in the low 80s for tonight. It's going to be really comfortable with low humidity. In fact, our dew points have dropped down into the upper 50s, which on our scale from where we were down here in that steamy, miserable category to pretty pleasant air that is overhead. And that should continue for the next couple of days. In the mountains, we've got highs in the 70s, mornings in the 50s Thursday and Friday. Morning temps close to 60 in the foothills and then in the low 60s to start in the triad with highs in the mid to upper 80s. So high pressure doing its job, clearing us out, pushing that front down to the south, and we will have mostly clear skies around for tonight and into tomorrow morning. It will be a little cool tomorrow morning for the ride into School Kenny, and on the buses you've got temperatures in the mid 50s in the mountains, so maybe consider a layer, a light jacket, depending on your temperature gauge with these things. 62 in the Piedmont triad tomorrow morning. New Noontime temperature close to 80 and a high tomorrow afternoon of 86 with a northeast breeze, which will be real comfortable, especially if you're headed out to Truist Field tomorrow night when Wake takes on VMI. You've got temperatures in the upper 70s to start a nice breeze. Clear skies should be a perfect football night weather wise. Here's your foothills forecast with a high of 85 tomorrow afternoon with lots of sunshine. Mountains up to about 78 after that cool morning. Also with the sunny skies and that northerly breeze. Looks like high school football fields will be dry Friday night. Mostly sunny, a little bit warm to start. Numbers dropping down into the 70s. We made a couple of adjustments with rain heading into the weekend. We've brought back that 20% chance on Saturday. Up that rain chance a little bit Sunday in to Monday because of what will likely set up across the area. High pressure is going to kind of nose in here. We'll get a northeast flow on Friday, should be dry, but the more easterly that wind gets coming off the Atlantic, I think we're going to get some clouds in here on Saturday, possible shower, a better chance of rain. It looks like potentially setting up on Sunday, especially for our mountain and foothill communities. By Saturday, if you are headed up to Boone to see the Tar Heels and the Mountaineers, you do have partly sunny skies. There'll be some clouds. We're also going to bring in a chance for some showers, so make sure you do have your rain gear. The Duke's Mayo Classic is Saturday in Charlotte at Bank of America Stadium. North Carolina A&T and North Carolina Central also a small chance for a shower that evening. Let's talk tropics where we have an 80% chance of this becoming our next tropical system, maybe a tropical depression. And right now forecast models have that moving to the west before a turn to the north. Let's look at our holiday weekend forecast where we've got temperatures down because of the clouds and that chance of rain. So highs in the low to mid 80s into Labor Day.